What's up guys, today we are watching episode 5 of Breaking Bad. So, last episode, Jesse went home to see his parents because he was like, you know, paranoid and everything. And in the end, he ended up getting kicked out because he took up for his brother and like, took blame for his weed. Which I still think was pretty shit. But I mean, he, he was being a good person, so props to him. But forget his brother. Anyways, Walt was going through a tough time because now, like, most of his family knows about his cancer because Skylar basically made him tell everyone. And now he's trying to figure out, like, how they're going to pay for, like, the treatments or whatever. In the ending scene, he ended up blowing up a dude's car. Well, he did stuff to help it, like, blow up, you know? But... I don't know, I'm kind of surprised that he didn't get caught for that, or maybe he did, I don't know. It just ended after that, so I guess let's see, so let's get into the episode. From Vite, which I think is more professional, but, uh, you know, same thing pretty much. <laughs> That's, uh, wow, great. Where is he applying? Necessary kind of thing. Well, and, uh, it doesn't really... But, um... Excellent. I just, I really feel I could be a major major asset to your sales force. Blink, Jesse, blink. You're staring. This, <laughs> this isn't actually a sales job. It's more like advertising. Oh, no. They're going to put them in one of those things. To learn like the helicopter. All right. Wow. Yeah. See? Yeah. It looks hard to do whenever the costume thing is really bulky, like. Yeah. I can hook you up with some pseudo. Major pseudo. I got channels, bro. We could partner up. Huh? You don't want him as a partner. Keep Walt. Didn't the invitation even say no gifts? Walt. What? We have to go. I know, I'm not complaining. Have to go where? Is it like a baby shower or something? Who else is having a baby though? Elliot! <laughs> Walt! You made it. <laughs> Happy birthday. I wouldn't miss it for the world. Thank you, it's a birthday. With all like the like cream colored stuff. I don't know. Why would it be a wedding? No one's supposed to wear white to a wedding, so I don't know why I was thinking that. That would be me. Find the room with the books. Huh. But it doesn't look like there's any interesting books, so I don't know. Walt? Don't. I thought that was you. I thought, I thought, what's her name? Skylar was telling him about the cancer. Like, if she keeps going around just telling people, bro, like. Came up with a name. <clears throat> Schwartz, Black, Walter White. So together they became Gray Matter Technologies. Thank you, Duh. Isn't that the name of the episode, too? No, that's, that's Gretchen and, and Elliot. Yum, good ramen. Walt and I <laughs> lived on for uh, 10 months straight while we were working on our thesis. <laughs> he seems to appreciate it, so. I love it. Thank you, Walt. Well. See, he appreciates the small gift, as everyone else should. Sure, yeah, absolutely. But you know what I mean is that that you and I should work together again. 
What are you going to teach high school? No, 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 seriously. Are you uh, asking me to come work for you at Gray Matter? Yeah, why not? You, you'd fit right in. You're brilliant. You, you, you got a ton of experience. Well, I. I'm happy for Walt, really but why is this coming out of the blue? God, I mean. Well, listen, Elliot, it. The offer is very appealing. It really is. I thank you, but. Uh, He's about to tell him about the cancer. It's, it's complicated. We can help you. We, we have excellent health insurance. He didn't even say it yet. So Skylar did tell him. Is that why he's offering him the job? Walt, what the hell did you say to Elliot? What? You told him about the cancer, didn't you? Didn't you? She's been telling everyone, man, and I'm like, I'm sorry I'm not liking her for it, but it's like he should be able to tell people if he wants. You think maybe you can just have said that? He's fine and then it would have been done. I don't like the way you're talking to I me. I don't like the way you talk about my private affairs. Oh, to Period, Walt. Well, say no, something. What exactly? Accept his charity. And then when I turned that down, he flat out offered to pay for my treatment. You Which is exactly what you expected him to do, didn't you? I did not put him up. Why is he randomly showing up at Jesse's place? Hey, dude, are these? Uh, no, nah, man. Those are for like, um, you know, uh, ventilation. Cool. Oh my God. Nice setup, huh? <laughs> There's a beaker. Here's a Griffin beaker. Here's a uh, volumetric beaker. Here's a, an Erlenmeyer flask. He's actually been uh, learning from all. Oh, wow. Really know your shit. It's just basic. Uh, uh, uh. What is he making? Is he gonna try and make his own stuff now? See the money? Here. Uh, I need five each. Come on, two more. Here. What about him? What is Walt Jr. buying? Whatever. Oh wait, is he just giving them the money? So businessmen are always not. Yeah, it is. <sighs> Guess you win the jackpot. This is not how I wanted to spend my night off. I, I could have talked my way out of it. Not cool, man. Not cool. What, you never tried to buy beer when you are my age? I'll talk about you calling me and not your father. How do you think I make him feel? When he finds out his dad's sick, he starts acting out, you know? First the pot, then this. The pot? His sister told him. Tell me if he was smoking weed. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> <laughs> I think he had it in him. It's like, why would anyone in their right mind choose not to do treatment, especially when it's completely paid for? Why is he doing this? But it's not completely paid for. You know what we need to do? What we really need to do? Well, no, just a family meeting where everyone can voice their concerns and be heard. So an intervention. So what? Cloudy, not cloudy? It looks good enough to me. <laughs> good enough. He about to throw it all out. Yo, what are you doing? Ah! Are you out of your mind? I totally would have smoked that. Look, it's not for you. It's for our customers. They're going to demand a certain standard. What are you? What? We'll just do it again until we get it right. Until he gets it like Waltz. Walt. Please have a seat and join us. Hmm. 
He's gonna throw that one out too. Three entire pounds of shit on wasted. Do you know how long I had to spend that stupid side? Get off me, psycho! Helicopter, bitch! What the fuck? He gonna try and shoot you. I mean, if you wouldn't have fallen and tried to fight him, you would have still been in there. Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, what I would say is that, uh... take, take, take the talking pillow. Uh, the talking pillow. Or you could hold on to your pride and lose the game. You get what I'm saying? No. Sam, I don't either. You got your pride, man. I get it. About a million things to say, probably. And now is your chance. Go ahead. Just let it all out. If you're gonna tell him to die again, then you shouldn't talk. This is bullshit. All right, come on. It, it's all right. Cause you're be you're being you, you're you're a pussy. You're like I did you not expect that. Personally, I think you should do whatever you want to do. What? Agreed. You told us to be honest about our feelings. Walt's the one with cancer. It's his decision. It's in treatment every day. I see them every day. And you know what? Some of them are absolutely miserable. Marie, I'm sorry. Period. She's and speaking facts and Skylar's mad. By their families. Hey, you know, can I get the pillow back? Because I, I agree with Marie on this Thank one. You. Hank. What? Maybe Walt wants to die like a man, all right? I don't want him to die at all. No one does, no, but. This. So either help or leave. this is so stupid. All right, I've got the talking pillow now. Throw that okay. shit to the side. Forget the talking pillow, man. Sometimes. I feel like I never actually make any of my own choices. I mean, he's speaking his truth. Don't say shit, Skylar. Is how I choose to approach this. Well, then make the right choice, Walt. Well, you're not the only one it affects. Oh my God! I'm sorry, but it's like. How do you decide what's the right and wrong choice, Skylar? I'm sorry. I'm aggravated with her. I've been aggravated with her. But what good is it to just survive if I am too sick to work? To enjoy a meal? To make love? She just don't get it. For what time I have left. So... That is my thought process, Skyler. I'm proud of Walter. Props to him. He spoke out. Thank you for I the talking pillow. Alright, what? I'll do the treatment. Good for you, but also, what was your whole speech for then? That's gotta feel weird. Is he back at Jesse's? Well, uh, Elliot told me about the cancer. I, I, I'm, I'm so sorry. You know, 
Yeah, it is what it is, I guess. Is this about you and me? Is she the girl that was filming the other episode whenever I was That's having, it. like, really flashbacks? Keep in touch, okay? Sure. Sure, yeah. Thank you for calling. Well, now he's gonna pay for it on his own. He's gonna have to tell him why he's back, so he's gonna have to tell him he has cancer, I think. Yeah! Wanna cook? Apparently, yes, he does want to cook. My god. It's like, I was so aggravated with Skylar this whole episode because of what, well, like, I guess the intervention and, like, turned out to be a good thing or whatever. And even though Walt got to speak his mind or whatever, he still chose to get treatment and I don't know if he's actually doing that for himself or if he's just doing it for Skylar like at this point he's he seems to be doing it for Skylar and I get it but I also feel bad because it's like he had that whole speech about like how he didn't want to go through all the pain and shit and now he's going to go through it while having to pay it himself since he told Gretchen that the insurance went through or whatever I think Gretchen is the girl from the other episode from the flashback thing. And apparently it seemed like they used to hook up, but I don't know if it was before or after Skylar. Like, did they have an affair and they just don't know? Like, they didn't tell him? It's like, it kind of seems like it. I don't know. But... I mean, at least he's going through with it, because I get... I get he wants to do it for his family, but if he didn't make that choice actually like for himself, I'd feel bad because in his whole speech he talked about how he barely got to make any any of his own decisions. Like, come on Walt, you had your chance and I understand you'd probably make Skylar mad. Everyone, everyone made Skylar mad. Because they basically just turned and said, do what you want to do, Walt. But it's like, as they should. Like, I don't know. Everyone was making her mad and it, it, it pissed me off. Because, like, in a way it did kind of backfire on her. Because her plan was to get them to change his mind. But, in a way, I guess it did. It's like, it did change his mind in a way unless, I don't know. It's just the whole thing, and then now, <laughs> now he's gonna be back cooking shit with Jesse. He'll be making bank, like. But still, I feel bad. I don't know. I need to see what happens between them, like more in the episodes. So I guess come back for episode six.